This simulation illustrates four possible errors during preoxygenation before the induction of general anesthesia. When the face mask is applied to the patient and the adjustable pressure limiting valve is closed, the reservoir bag will distend and high pressures will be reached within the breathing circuit. This gives the patient the unpleasant sensation of difficulty breathing. If the mask is applied without a fresh gas flow of oxygen, the reservoir bag will eventually collapse and the patient will not be able to inspire, generating negative pressures within the breathing circuit. This is extremely uncomfortable and disconcerting for the patient who may become agitated. If an inhaled anesthetic vaporizer is left on after the previous case and not turned off before the beginning of the following case, the patient will inspire an inhaled anesthetic which in addition to being unpleasant, can inadvertently induce general anesthesia. If the lever that selects manual or mechanical ventilation is not appropriately adjusted to manual ventilation, the ventilator bellows will ascend and descend without the anesthesiologist having the ability to ventilate the patient using the reservoir bag. In summary, these errors can be prevented by developing a systematic approach to opening the adjustable pressure limiting valve, having an adequate oxygen flow, making sure that the vaporizers are closed, and selecting manual ventilation on the anesthesia machine.